Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. So, as you can see behind me, I have a ton of pallets. And if you don't know, um, I like to woodwork and pretty much all my builds are built with pallets. Um, so I have, I think, over 27 of them. Um, right here, all these three rows are all the same pallets. Uh, you can see they have some really nice 2x4s and they're pretty nice boards. Over here is a mix of them. There is eight of them right here, so they're not as nice of boards. But you can see down here there's some different colored ones, which might be cool for something. So if you've watched my previous videos, you've seen that I've used this big crowbar right here. Um, it's really nice for getting leverage on really, really thick boards that are really stuck. But the problem is, when you go to pry up, it's only prying up on this corner right here, and usually snaps the board right here. Uh, this happens especially with wider boards like these ones compared to these. Out of each of these pallets, I think there's like maybe 10 boards. And out of 10, I probably will break on average like 6 boards with the pry bar over there. So I decided to get this pallet buster. It was about $52 on Amazon, so we'll see how well it works. Um, I've done a few little tests. I've taken apart a couple boards, and so far, I'm really liking it. So this video is basically going to be taking apart all of these pallets, or at least most of them for now. So what I've seen on previous videos that I've watched, and based on what I've tested already... Um, I like to start from the ends and then do the middle and then the other end. That seems to work out pretty good for me. Uh, this board is already started so I'll just finish it off real quick. And then over here, you can see I have already taken apart a few of the pallets. So over there are the wide boards, here's the skinnier boards, and here's the 2x4s. So I've taken apart, I think, three or four pallets already with the crowbar. And you can see I've got quite a bit, even with how many I've broken. So, yeah, I'm going to get quite a bit of boards here. So I'll probably do a time lapse of everything. And then after we're done taking them apart, we're going to have to pound all the nails out from each board. And that's how simple it is. It's pretty easy, so I'll just keep working at this. Alright, so it's getting laid out. Um, it's almost 6 o'clock right now. And I don't really want to do this in the dark. But I got one whole pile done. And then partial one. 
here is all the pieces. So the pile grew quite a bit. And here's the two by fours. And out of about eight pallets that I did, this is all the broken ones, which is not too many. If I would have done it with the bar over there, the pile would have been probably about as big as these piles over here. So I definitely really like this thing so far. So that's the end of day one, and we'll see you tomorrow. Alright guys, so it's the next day. The temperatures dropped quite a bit, so it's about 16 degrees out right now. So it's a bit chilly, but pallets are here, so we can get back to work. And just like that, we have two of the rows done. Uh, I'm actually gonna leave this one here for now because over here, I think I have plenty of wood to do a ton of projects. And I don't have a whole lot of room in the basement and this is probably gonna take up a lot of room. So these are the piles. You can see the wide boards and the uh, not so wide boards. There's quite a bit more wide boards, but that's okay. And then over here, we have all the two by fours, which is quite a mound. You can see how tall it is. So I'd say I've taken apart about 20 pallets, which is pretty good. So now that I've got everything taken apart, uh, I now need to bring all these boards down in the basement and start taking off all of the nails. Alright guys, so I've been working on these pallets for about a week now and um, all I have left is to get these wider boards, um, all the nails off of them. And uh, there's quite a bit, but it's getting kind of boring for you guys to just sit here and watch me take out nails. So I wanted to show you over here what I'm doing with the boards. Um, over here are all the 2x4s, and sorry about the shadows. Um, right here is the not so wide boards, and then over here are the wider boards. So I've also been taking apart some of the pallets that I had down here even more, just to get them out of here. So this scrap pile over here is getting pretty big, uh, so I'm going to figure out something to do with that. But so this is where I'm putting all those 27 pallets. I am going to be taking apart the other pallets too, the, eventually. So anyway guys, that's going to be the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, 
my final review on the palette buster uh, I really really like it uh, if you take apart a lot of palettes or build with them or whatever um, I highly suggest getting that because it really really helped so I hope you guys enjoyed this video thanks for watching and see you in the next one Thank you.